Hi guys, it's Rosie here. I hope everyone's doing great. So today guys, we've got the makeup stash, which is the travel edition. Obviously, um, I normally have this bag in my car because sometimes I have to get ready for work and, you know, I don't have time to put a little bit of makeup on. It's just like really bare face and I don't think I could stand that one because I have like kind of like a mature skin and i need to cover up a little bit of those but anyway i've got some stash for the makeup um travel so i thought you know i'll just gonna show you what we've got here so first as you can see this is an awful brush this is a bare minerals i know bare minerals it's got a lot of nice stuff but um i don't think i can stand this one so i think um i'm gonna choke this out after this just to show to you because if you can see guys all the brushes are like shredding and you can see all of that <laughs> so it's not very nice at all so that is the um brush that i normally take but i only got this one for a few months but obviously uh, i need to choke it out because it's not very good every time i use it it's just falling off all the hairs are falling off so that's a no but anyway i'm just going to show you like what i said and then the next one that we've got here is i've got my brush here uh, which is this is a very nice brush it's a dual brush i can't even remember what is this made <laughs> but yes it is a a brush that you can use you know it's quite handy so um yeah that's the brush and then obviously i normally bring something like a, a body lotion um, so sometimes I use this one as a hand cream if I don't bring any of the hand cream so yeah that's one up here it's it's one yeah so yeah I bring this and then the next one that we've got is we've got this one here which is the Vichy uh, Derma Blend oh my god this um this uh, foundation has been with me for quite some time I don't really need it because I don't need really full coverage but I thought you know um, it's just a sort of you know when you're looking for an adds you know you can see it and it seems nice so i thought i'll just use it but yes i only need a tiny bit when bit, I, I only need a tiny bit of this one and it's kind of like good um i don't think i can open it but i'll just I'll, I'll, if i got the time i'll open this one guys for you um so and then obviously i've got this one here i've got the stila oh this is very nice this is a creamy blush uh it's the convertible convertible color uh, i don't know why but anyway it is a very nice brush and uh, let me just show you there you go guys if you can see it's been overly used so that's the one and this one i've got it from my beauty box so i've got this one it's like a a primer um yeah this is very con md as you can see guys Ooh, it's disgusting <laughs> but no it's not um i've just recently used that one so that's why the some of the foundation went in but i just used this as a primer and even though without any foundation this is as good as the foundation as well so this is a pericon md it's a it's in one of the beauty boxes guys so that's the one and then i've got this one as well uh, which is a super glue hyaluronic acid so this is the um skincare before putting all the foundation and the primer i use this one here uh, it's summer so i thought you know i'm just gonna put this one here well it's not summer but it's uh, springtime <laughs> so yeah then I've got a brush it's a tiny brush it's a travel brush it's like a kid's brush so this one is foldable actually so you can fold that one like that I'm um, sorry about the hair <laughs> but yes that is uh, in here as well okay this is a Bella Pierre lipstick it's LS002 for the shade <laughs> it's overused as well so this is from the beauty box so I've just used this one I just like the color of it because I think it is like more of a work color you know like a lip color um for work really so yeah and then we've got the elf uh, for the brow um i've just added this one here today um and those are the shades this one's got a little mirror as well um yeah so this is very nice then i've got the hydrating primer as well i use this one if i don't use the Vericon md and then i've got the highlighter which is the glam glow again it's from the beauty box um, this is a highlighter and then I've got the Elemis which is a eye cream as well before I put all my makeup and I put it with a combination of all the skincare and then I've got the lip care uh, which is this is a lip balm um, so if I don't feel like I want to use any lipstick I can use this one as well and again this is a I think this is from last year <laughs> but there's still some left in this one so yeah it is a tanning lotion uh, which is good for the summer really so i've got my sponge and yeah i normally um put a new one all the time like every 
two days if I don't have time to clean it. Um, but this literally this is just been put on from a few days ago, maybe about four days ago, and look at how it looks now. Uh, but yes, it needs to be washed. Then I've got this one as well. Sometimes I do clean them first before I put makeup because you know what? Sometimes I have to leave early for work and I'm quite too early um, and just staying in my car. So um, sometimes I I need to do a lot of this one because I've got plenty of time when I get to my workplace. So And then I've got this sharpener, which is a must all the time with all my any of my makeup um, beauty set. So it needs to be there. <laughs> right so i've got all of this one guys if you can see they're all all stashed but this one i like this one i don't know where i got this one but this is for my brow and then this is for like concealer oh not concealer yes this is a concealer actually but this is an eyebrow concealer like um what you call this like a primer for the eyebrow sorry before putting your eyebrow on and then this one it's for contouring actually but it's for everything really you can use it as a lipstick for the cheeks i don't know if i can open it up for you guys um you see, um, I like the color of it, so yeah, um, oh yeah, you can take it out, yeah, so that's the one, so you can use that one as a bronzer as well, or for your contouring if you want, I don't do a lot of contouring <laughs> but yes, it is for my bronzer, um, so that's the one, so again, this is from Boots, this is a concealer, this is a nice one as well, so that's why I don't check it out, <laughs> so yeah, yeah, and I've got another lip care, and then I've got some cream again. It's an eye cream. This is a Lord and Berry. This is a lip liner. Okay, that's a shade, guys. So this is another lip liner, and this is from Huda Beauty. As you can see, it's all well used. <laughs> so that's why I need the sharpener. So yeah. And then I've got some Ico eyeliner, and I've got this one. I think this is Maybelline. It's an eyeliner, but this is a green one, and this is a black one. And I've got another foundation from Lancome um, because I'm working on a project so sometimes I put like two or three in all my makeup box set um, for my foundation so this one is very nice it's kind of like too bright for me as well so sometimes I combine it with the other foundation which I'm going to show you in a minute and again some extra brushes I've got this one from Amazon um, it is a set but I don't know where are the rest of the set <laughs> Then I've got this Bare Minerals uh, Mascara. It's a serum infused mascara, which I really love this. This is one of my favorite actually. So like what I said, a lot of Bare Minerals products are kind of good, but I'm just kind of like put off with one of the powder that I've got, like powder foundation and that one with the brush with it. Um, so I just hated those uh, products, but this one is just beautiful. So this is the brush. Um, this one is a good brush actually, because it's kind of like too small and I've got like um, fine, very fine eyelashes. So this is very good. And obviously I've got a tiny perfume all the time. So I've got this one from Yardley. It's a sample. So again, this is from the latest in beauty box. Um, it's a splash from them. And again, it's a tiny perfume and it is from the latest in beauty box. Um, you know, um, I'm not very good with the scent, so I can't describe. But yes, it does smell nice, <laughs> but they don't last longer really. But it's okay. And this one is another facial moisturizer. Again, this is from the beauty box. This is the Mimitica. I don't know which beauty box it is, but it is good for the moisturizer uh, prep, you know, like a face prep before putting all your foundation. It's got SPF 50, you know, so this is nice. Actually, I think I set this uh, makeup uh, box um, stash uh, from last year. So that's why if you can see um, it all like um, more of a um, summer based thing uh, makeup. Um, so this is the SPF 50. And then, oh, I've got this one, you know, I've got this one from the, it was a Phil Unique before, but it's now Sephora. And I've got this one, they've got like good sample, and um, it is a all-nighter, um, like, you know, a primer or a setting uh, spray makeup. Um, and this is one of the best, um, so I like, I like to have one of those. So I think, I, don't, I think I've got quite a few of this one. So this one is the one I'm using right now. Yes, I've still got the box because it's my favorite normally for all my favorite stuff. I keep the box and put them in a like a separate box so I know um, those are my favorites. So this is the, um, sorry, this is the All Nighter Urban Decay Long Lasting Makeup Setting Spray and it's up to, um, it was up to 16 hour wear, uh, which is true. Um, so this is one of my favorite, um, yeah. And this one is my foundation, so I combine it with the Lancome, and this is the Urban Decay. Oh, I love this one. It's like um, just like a skin. 
um, skin um, skin tint really um, so it's very very nice um, you don't feel like very cakey or I don't feel like you're full of makeup so it's just like kind of like a, a skincare that you put to your, to your face and um, so this is the type of uh, foundation that I like nowadays so it's very nice it is a bit like very dark to my color or to my skin color but like what said I combine it with a light foundation and it just works really well and I just put a little you know like a little bit amount you don't need a lot <laughs> in fact this is from last year and um, so this is one of my favorites so yes so this is the uh, naked skin urban decay so as you can see there guys it is a weightless ultra definition uh, liquid um, foundation well, liquid makeup and um, let me show you the pumps it is a pump base and I don't know if I can pump you can see that one don't want to waste it but yeah that is the shade of it um don't know if you can see it guys but this is 8.75 and um, that is the number of this uh, foundation um so yeah and i've got my eyeshadow palette this is one of my favorite as well this is the urban decay on the run and um, so this one it says detour on the run planet uh, palette sorry <laughs> planet Pla palette um so yes it is an eyeshadow palette and um, it's got like a a, a mirror inside so let me just show you all the shades so these are the shades you can see i can i, I, I use mostly this plus two here because they are like the natural colors and then obviously if i'm planning to go out after work and i'm still using my car so i've got all a little bit of the glam up look with that blue shades there and you know you can mix and match it this is a very good foundation really i'm not foundation sorry <laughs> a very good um, eyeshadow palette um, so this is very nice um, so yeah you can see all of that so that are the shade of the Creed Dash Escape Detour uh, I don't know what's that it's been uh, couldn't read it and then Confidential so as you can see both Confidential and the other one are the one that I use the most and then obviously if you want the Glam Up Night as well like coming up from work and going for a night out so that's the Switchback and the Plunge but you can use any really if you want and um, so yeah this is the um, eyeshadow palette and obviously i've got a bit of a sh hair bubble in there and for some reason i've got some scissors in there as well i don't know why but anyway i've got that one there i'm sure there is a purpose for that and this little makeup bag i've got this one from amazon so it is like very nice because you can just lay your makeup all together like that and then obviously it's got like a little pocket i think this one has got like i've got like a a, um, a blade <laughs> for um eyebrow um shaving yeah so i've got some um for eyebrow sh shaving really um so i've got those one and i forgot <laughs> i've got the setting powder my favorite so i always put them there because the only thing that i don't like here is the lid you see so once it falls off and then you drop it and that's it so i normally just put it there to be on the safe side and um, so this is a very good makeup um obviously you can see and you did wash in but i mean you know that's all just the stain and everything so this is from amazon and you can just pull that little twist there and you can just lay all your makeup there all together without you know uh, looking for anything underneath <laughs> so this is kind of like handy and it's got like a little flop cover in there um then again i've got this one here as well as a cream for the um body lotion cream and i use it as a hand cream <laughs> it's ritual so it smells lovely so if you like rituals uh, this is one of my stash then for the hair, I get the Hair Apology. Again, this is from one of my beauty boxes. And this is from the Advent Calendar, I think. This is Lee Stafford. Then in one leave-in treatment spray conditioner. And then I've got a little bit of the um, hair spray as well. I don't use this much, but, you know, sometimes if I need to, then I do. Especially if you got, like, the baby hair on the top. So I use this one as well. Um, so, yeah, this is all my travel stuff makeup, guys. I hope this is something that you have find useful um so you know um <laughs> so yeah so i i've got makeup everywhere um it's not like you know um like a high-end makeup or anything but it's what the normal people um use or normal people does um so again thank you so much for watching guys and i hope that you've found something um something that you like to use um in here and yeah that's it so again thank you so much for watching and if you haven't subscribed don't forget to press your subscribe button and the notification bell so you always get notified every time i have a new one like this again thank you so much for watching take care everyone bye